Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create this cool YouTube video effect in Camtasia 9. All right, so I got this cool idea and it integrates YouTube and video at the same time. So let me show you what I mean here. So right now I'm on our YouTube channel and I'm going to take a screenshot of this page. And you might be thinking, what? Screenshot? Let me show you what I mean. You'll understand in the next couple of clips here. So I'm gonna take a screenshot and I've got Jing up here to take the screenshot. And I'll just take it from, let's say, here. And if you don't have Jing, it's a really cool uh, screenshot tool that makes it easier to take screenshots. So I'm going to capture that. And I'll just take, I'll just name it YouTube Screenshot. And then I'm going to click Save. It's going to save it on my desktop. And now I will meet you guys in Camtasia. Okay, so now I'm going to import that screenshot that I took of my YouTube channel here, and I'm going to place it on the screen just like this. And I'll stretch it out a bit. Okay, and then let's make it a bit longer just to stretch it out a bit. Okay. And then I've got a test video here, and this is more of like a stylistic thing, like if you've got a YouTube channel, you can do this with any kind of screenshot. It's going to look really cool. So I've got this video here that I was just playing around with, and I'm going to delete the screen, and I only have the video here, and I'll just uh, mute the... I'll just mute the audio for a second. I didn't mean to speed up that. So we'll just mute the audio. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this video here where the YouTube video would normally go. And it might not fit fully, but that's okay. We can play around with the sizing here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the crop tool and I'm going to crop this down just a little bit and then I'm going to crop up just a little bit and then I'm going to put move this up here and I'm going to put a black uh, rectangle behind me but on top of the screenshot so that it looks like it's a video format so I'll just stretch this out. Again, I want to match the dimensions of the video here. There we go. And then there we go. And then I'm just going to stretch this out. And let's click play. So as you can see, I've got a screenshot here of my YouTube channel, but it looks like the video is playing. And another cool thing that you can do here is you can have this pop out and be your actual video. So you can have this as like a cool intro and then it pop out sort of like zoom in and have it be your actual video. I'll show you what I mean here in a second. Okay, so let's go back to the beginning. We'll play a little bit of that here. So that looks like it's my YouTube channel. It looks like this is an actual video playing but we're also going to do a cool effect now. So let's say that's playing and you're doing like an intro or something. And then this turns into the actual screen. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight both of these things, not the YouTube screen here. And I'm going to head over to animations and I'm going to head over to this animations tab. So it's animations, animations. And then I'm going to click on custom. And then let's say we want it to start off here. And then while still having both of them highlighted, 
I'm going to stretch both of them out so that they take up the entire screen. So just need to play around here and move this to the center and stretch this out here and then we'll stretch this out here so it covers the whole thing and then let's pretend that's the middle let's see here okay so let's click play to test this out here and it's all about testing and trying things out this is how I get most of my ideas is I'm just thinking of something and then I go let's see how if we can figure this out so as you can see it just stretched out and it turned into the main focus of the video so I'll go back and I'll play it again here so you're playing you're in the YouTube video you know it's it looks like it's on the YouTube channel and then all of a sudden the video pops out and becomes the actual screen and you know you can do another thing and you can go backwards if you wanted to so what we can do is just rewind here a little bit and let's say we wanted it to go backwards well you would highlight both of those things again put a custom animation down at the place where you want it let's say right here and then you would go and put it back in place to where it was before so let's just stretch this back down and we'll move it back in here this one kind of moved out of place but I'll move it back okay it's kind of eyeballing it here it's not exactly perfect but you guys get it so we'll start it from the beginning I'll press play okay so I'm in the YouTube video it's like I'm on my YouTube channel and then it's going to pop out full screen right and then it's gonna go back into the YouTube channel so that is like a cool effect that you guys can do in your projects and in your videos alright guys so that is the cool effect that I want to share with you guys on how to integrate video and a screenshot of your YouTube channel to make it look like you're coming out of the channel and then you're going back into the channel so if I was able to help you out at all please let me know by giving this video a like a comment or subscribe all that would be very much appreciated all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Back from the dead.